We're Steph and Travis, Canadians who didn't know much about sailing. We didn't let that or a global pandemic stop us from living our dream, and we've been winging it ever since. We took off from Toronto and made it to Grenada in year one, and we've got no plans on stopping. Subscribe to join our life on the water. Thanks to our patrons who keep the dream going. After we got our freezer issue resolved and everything all fixed, we decided to change things up this morning and just move around the corner from where we were, literally just out the anchorage around to the next bay. And we saw a bunch of nice beaches and white sand, good depths. So we figured it was a good spot to drop our anchor. It's not a marked anchorage point on the charts, but it looked really good to us. And we're the only boat here, so even better. You just jumped off the back of the boat, swam to shore, and we saw how beautiful it was. So I had to come back to the boat, grab the GoPro so that we can show you guys. But I feel like you really can't go wrong here in Antigua because we've just, every corner we've turned, it's pristine beachfront after pristine beachfront, white sand, inviting waters, great views, and it's just really pretty. So we're gonna show you guys. Okay, we're gonna head over Well, that definitely freaked me out a little bit because the water is not the super clear. Clear enough that I could see that. But I've never seen a jellyfish that big before. Really pretty because you can see all the real purple in there, but definitely a big one. wanted a photo. She wanted me to take a photo of her doing a pose on the beach and she had her eyes closed, arms above her head. But she left it there like, I don't know, 20 seconds. I was like, I don't need that long to take a photo. So I just ran off on her. <laughs> and then she like looked up, like realized that I wasn't there. That's too funny. I like messing with her. Oh, I just 
got instant payback. I just stepped on a cactus. Uh, uh, they're everywhere. Uh, uh, well, that's what I get for messing with her. Ah. Uh, Stepped on us. I don't know if it's a cactus or those things. Oh yeah, it's stepped on. Oh yeah, it's cacti. It's in me. Ow! It's uh, me. It's burrs. It's the stickers. Ah! Uh, Would you call that karma? Yeah, that's what I said. Ah! Uh. If you guys have been following our journey for a little while now, then you may know that before we left, a little over a year ago, we had no experience in filming, no experience in editing, or pretty much anything involved with making a YouTube video. So it's been a lot of learning, and I'm constantly learning, trying to make our content better. Uh, you might have noticed that in some of our more recent videos, when we go on little hikes or walks, we'll try to incorporate little transitions in there just to keep things interesting. I personally think they're entertaining to watch, and they're fun to make. So we just recently anchored at a new spot and we're about to check out another hike. There's supposed to be some really nice views overlooking the harbor. So when we take you guys along, we're hoping to make it a little more fun and creative. And we have Skillshare to thank in helping us with that and for sponsoring this week's episode. I've been taking Skillshare classes for a little while now and the class I'm currently taking is led by Maddie Brown. It's called Filming Scene Transitions, Creative Techniques on a Budget. And I really like this class because I don't need to buy any add-ons for our editor program or anything like that. And the techniques shown are really easy, they're simple to do, yet look pretty cool. So the one that we like using a lot is what he refers to as the whoosh, which is where at the end of one scene, you'll end off with a swift movement of the camera, say a downwards motion. And in your next scene, you'll start off with that same downwards movement. So that when you piece the clips together, you create one seamless fluid movement that looks pretty neat. I'm hoping that by continuing to take classes on Skillshare, my editing gets better and our videos are more enjoyable for you guys. If you're looking at exploring a new skill or maybe delving a little bit deeper into an existing one, I would say that Skillshare is a great place to start because there are a ton of classes on a whole variety of topics and right now for free. Because Skillshare is offering the first 1,000 of our subscribers who use the link that I'm going to put in the description box below, a one month free trial to Skillshare. So you guys can check it out and hopefully you find it as useful as we have. So we are going to hop off this boat, check out this hike, and hopefully you guys enjoy it. See if you guys can spot the whoosh that we like so much. We're always getting lost trying to find a trail. So what we did, we cleared out of customs today. Um, then we went around the corner to a place called Deep Bay, where we're gonna stage for heading over to Barbuda tomorrow, which is like a five hour sail, four hour sail, four or five hours. And it's a cute little bay, we're just gonna check it out because there's a little, little hike up here. It's pretty cool. 
Hey, found it. It's been really windy the past few days in Antigua. It's been a few windy days here in Antigua, so we didn't get up to all too much in terms of swimming and stuff. As you saw, the water was kind of murky, but all in all, still had a great time here. Love the island, and I'm so happy that we stopped here. Yeah, it's been a really cool island. A lot of cool little nooks and crannies and bays and stuff like that to go into. Oh, it's howling. It's so windy. Woo! Uh, it's a 28 plus knot gust. Yeah. There's white caps in the bay right now. Not there. Yeah. Windy! A lot more Canadian boats here, I would say, because in the French islands, definitely seen a lot of French cruisers and tourists, but we've seen so many Canadian boats here. Yeah, it's been a lot of us. <laughs> we ran into a lot of them and just chatted with them. And People had stopped us on the street saying that they had recognized us, and they're like, is that Gypsy? I thought you guys were Martinique. So our videos are a few weeks delayed because obviously we're not uploading in real time. That would just be crazy. I think it's cool that people will even watch us, to be quite honest. Still a shock to us that people watch our videos. <laughs> yeah. We just, I guess, really want to say thank you to everyone that's um, stopped us along the way and just invited us onto their boat or into their home. Also to anybody who has ever sent us a nice message, encouraging words online. We appreciate it all because it really gives us motivation to continue making videos because if I know that you guys are liking it, that's going to make me want to make videos more. It's like, I don't know, it just motivates me. It really makes us feel good. So we enjoy all that good stuff. Yeah. What about the people that don't leave nice comments? <laughs> yeah. Definitely like meeting everybody. Yeah, it's super awesome. So we just really want to say thank you. And if you ever see us on the street, always just come say hey. Because yeah. we enjoy that. We hope you enjoyed Travis's little prank in this video. I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> Honestly, well, like, I was trying to make a thumbnail for this video or something. Just take a nice photo and it would have been quite embarrassing if there was anybody else on the island that caught me just standing there with my arms up and my eyes closed by myself <laughs> for I don't know how long, like 20 seconds. <laughs> Someone just watching you. But luckily... <laughs> but luckily... <laughs> There was nobody there, so when I opened my eyes, it just like, felt like an idiot by myself. <laughs> that was the point. <laughs> so funny. So funny. I got it in the foot. <laughs> <laughs> and the elbow. And the elbow. Poor thing. But yeah. Okay, guys. Well, we will see you next Friday. And if you aren't subscribed already, we hope you hit that subscribe button. Please. Over there. Over here. Over there. I think it's going to be over there. But yeah. Give us a comment, all of that good stuff, and we will see you next Friday. Bye. Thanks, guys. Well, that was supposed to be that. Thanks, guys. <laughs>